I am proud to say I am a painter. After all these years, I finally realized I'm a painter of life and mistakes. I thrive on mistakes, and I uh, encourage students to make mistakes because then they can solve them on their own. My mind was not really in books. It was in looking. And I did plenty of that. So not only in the Navy, but on the river. That's why I bought myself a little rowboat. I found it up in Placerville for $25 and I put it out here on the river. Just sat there and watched the sunset, sunrise. People say, well, that's where the blues come in. No, but that, Cezanne was responsible for the blues. I finally found somebody that opened my eyes to nature and I made a career and a life for myself. And that's what students in the art world, they have to get a godfather someplace. You know, after a while you get pretty vicious with your uh, composition. I can still think well. My eyes are still good. To some people, I'm a legend. I'm not a artist, I'm a painter. That's two different fields. A painter is one who paints. An artist is a guy that tries to do everything, like even string beads. I never saw that challenge of, oh, I'm going to Cal, you know, and you're going to Stanford. In the art field, it was the teacher. There was one teacher I really believed in at Sac State, his name was Paul Beckman. And you couldn't have asked for a better setting than the site where Sac State is. You know, beautiful river, lovely trees. You know what Sac State really did? It opened the door to who makes the art. Gregory Connors, a painter. I made it at Sac State. Thank you.